Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Taylor Don. So today is insulation day. It is May 2nd and I'm finally getting these locks in. So I actually got up this morning, made me some coffee, all that good stuff. And I probably started putting my locks in around nine-ish. I'm gonna show you guys here in a minute. And right now it's a little after 1300, but I didn't work like all the way through. You know, I took little breaks here and there, but I'll probably at least work a good three hours on the few locks that I put in. Um, let me just show you guys real quick. Can y'all see that? So I finally completed the whole nape area of my head. Um, and it took a long time. A good hour of that was me trying to interlock those little fine hairs. And I didn't realize, I mean, I guess I kind of knew, I guess I forgot how thin my nape area is. And so after a while, it just clicked. And I was like, girl, what are you doing if you don't braid that hair and keep it moving? So with that being said, this whole back area are braid locks. So I braided it and then uh, on the majority of them, I did interlock um, the base. I did maybe like a half rotation because there wasn't that much space in between the braid and the scalp. And yeah, and guess what? I am perfectly fine with that. Matter of fact, once I started braiding, then I was able to speed up and it became a lot faster. But now that the nape area is done, I am getting up to the thicker hairs in my um in my head. So I will be able to start interlocking. But back here, they were so fine. And I don't know if you guys, you could probably see how thin those hairs is. And I'm like, I couldn't. I can't, I didn't. And so they are definitely braid locks back there in the nape area and I'm cool with that. So real quick, I do wanna update you guys. In the last video, in my grid video, I was telling you um, some lines I wanted to correct. And so I actually did, I don't know if you guys can see, well, I'm about to show you. So here, it was a little stagnant a little bit. So I did straighten this line out. So now uh, I'm happy with that, uh, as well as the other side, uh, you guys can probably see. You guys can probably see that now it's, it's straight, uh, or straighter than it was yesterday. So I'm happy with my grid overall. But yeah, um, I'm just going to continue working. I'm going to do this little short intermission. Finally, my breakfast that, um, well, now it's brunch, but eat my breakfast and continue working and see how much I can get completed today. I do have other stuff I need to do. So it's not like my hair is my main focus because I'll, I'll get done when I get done. So, but for the most part, um, I'm just going to continue working and I'll come and check back in with you guys later. Hey you guys. So I'm back. It's the end of the night and I'm looking crazy. I'm looking super tired. So I've been doing my hair on and off pretty much all day. Um, not consistent though. I actually um, like lost track of time or however long I've been working on my hair. But um, I got to a good stopping point. It's super late. I'm not about to, I'm not going to do any more tonight. I thought about just doing it until um like to it's time to go to bed but it's almost that time so i think i'm just gonna relax because my shoulders and my arms honey are hurting they're really sore so i want, just want to show you the tools that i was using or i've been using so i'm pretty sure you guys probably seen one of these before uh it's a a yarn needle i just cut it kind of opened up the 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 hole a little bit more so I can stick my hair through it. So this been helping really, really good. And I also have this and I ordered this on Amazon. And uh, right now it's a little, I feel like it's a little too long, but um, I mean, I like it, but I just feel like it's a little too big. But um, anyways, I'm just gonna continue on my, with my yarn needle cause that's what works for me at the moment until I want to go get something else, but let me let me show you what I've done 
today. Let me just show you. So I completed the whole Nate area. And I'm loving it so far. I still have a ways to go, but I'm going to get there. Um, eventually, I'm going to get there. And once I get finished, then I'll be done. This is the hardest part. The install is the hardest part. The longest um, process, I guess I should say. But, um, yeah, so the back's done. Uh, I just had it, like, once I got done with the section, I just braided it up. And that's why uh, it kind of look all stiff and everything but that's okay um and then tomorrow i'll work on this middle section um but yeah like i said i'm not in like a super rush i mean i would like to get done sooner than later but i know i would definitely be done this week um i'm gonna try to get as much done tomorrow and then throughout the week i'll just continue working on it but like i said i'm pretty sure not pretty sure I will be wearing a wig to work. Uh, if, in case um, this is your first time to my channel, I am in the military. Um, and yeah, I'm excited about this, this lock journey. I'm glad that uh, we are authorized to wear locks. So uh, I've been waiting on that, trust me. But yeah, you guys, that's it for today. I'm about to um, shut it down. And we're going to start back up in the morning. So, Man, that's some good coffee. All right, y'all. It's the next day. I'm looking like a hot mess. But you know what? It's Sunday. It's a relaxing day. It don't matter. I just wanted to come on here real quick to show you guys what I plan to do today. Um... And I'm going to be realistic with myself because I have a lot of stuff to do today. I have a lot of house stuff to do. Um, watch clothes, all that stuff. And I have some videos I need to record to get up on my channel, some budgeting videos. So I'm just going to show you guys real quick what uh, I plan to do today. Um, remove all of these out the way. Uh, let's see. I'm still going to be working on the back. And towards the end of the night, I need to figure out how I'm going to uh, wear my wig for tomorrow for work. Okay, let me get my mirror. All right, so oh, this is already done. So I want to do this one and this one. So these two are the ones that I want to do today. If I can get to more, I will at least, I, I want to at least get these two done. Uh, I might get more done because once I like put my clothes in the um, wash and and you know in between doing a lot of things that I can like sit on the couch and do a few, but at least these and I'm thinking that these would be sixteen a piece, so sixteen blocks in each one of these squares. So yeah, and I forgot to tell you guys, so last yesterday, um, when I did this whole bottom section, I forgot to tell you my lot count. So as of yesterday, or starting today, my lot count is 77. So these are um, 77 locks back here. So I think I'm going to try to do that at the end of each day when I come back and check in with you guys to let you know what my lot count is. Um... Let's see what else that I forgot to mention. And that I will, of course, um, address in like future videos. But I don't know if I told you what rotation. Did I tell you I'm doing like the four-point rotation? I don't know if I did. But I am doing a four-point rotation clockwise entering into three, six, nine, twelve. And I think it's important... Did I say entering? Because I know, well, at least for myself, sometimes that can be confusing when I hear other lockers saying their cardinal direction, but not necessarily saying are they entering or exiting um, a direction. So entering 3, 6, 9, 12 is how I'm doing it. But even if I was to do exiting, I would enter into the 3, exit 
at the um the nine and I said a cardinal direction. If I'm saying cardinal direction to be, you know, east or west, but clockwise, let's think of a clock, right? So if I'm entering um, three, X mean nine, entering six, X mean 12, it's still nine, 12, three, six. So it's still clockwise regardless. But I just wanted to clear that up so that there's no confusion or whatever the case may be. But anyways, with that being said, I'm about to go sit down and enjoy my coffee before I get started on all that I need to do today. So I will come back later and check in with you guys. Hey you guys, I'm back and I'm looking crazy still. But um, today was a good productive day. I did accomplish what I said I was gonna accomplish. Let me turn around so you can see. So I did do these two sections back there and um, I was multitasking pretty much all day, so I was like um, doing my locks and editing, and um, I put a video, my debt payoff for April video on my channel, and I'm also uploading my grid video, so that should be up by the time you see this video, but yeah, um, it's the end of the night, or end of the day, it's about 2000, and I'm about to cook me some dinner and um kind of wind down for tonight i may or may not do more lots i guess it just depends on how i feel like i say it is kind of late and i do need to get up to go to work in the morning so what i do need to figure out is how i'm going to lay this hair down flatten this hair out so i can throw a wig on i do need to figure that piece out but other than that um yeah so I think my lock count is, let's see real quick. Cause I had um, ended last night with 77 and I did 32 today because each one of these squares were squares of 16. So I'm at 109 locks so far, you guys. So yeah, that's it. I'm not really sure how I'm gonna, um, do these videos maybe i do like two or three days at a time then i'll post it i don't know i guess we'll figure it out but anyways um if not then i'm gonna go ahead and end this video here for day one and day two and then i'll come back in another video with day three so yeah you guys go ahead and subscribe hit like comment on this video and i'll see you in the next one bye